Yo, what's going on, people? It's your boy Wuzo. We back again with another video of this arena breakout. Now, before we continue on, I must let y'all know this video is sponsored. So shout, so shout out to Arena Breakout for sponsoring said video and content. Now, like I said in the previous video, um, I'm gonna show y'all my actual very first game of me just dropping in, playing, catching a couple bodies, getting some loot, and hitting the dash on them. Now, forewarning, I'm using my thumbs here to aim, and y'all know I struggle with these thumbs right here. To aim now i use mouse and keyboard i'm now spoiled using my whole arm and fingers to now navigate things so don't judge me on some of the gameplay that you're gonna see and we're gonna commentate on it as we go along you hear me let's get into it all right so you know the drill we here just to land get loot and dip the hell out now, let me go ahead and tell y'all this. I was mortally terrified of just dropping in like this. I'm not used to just being here dolo playing this type of game. However, your boy does play Siege, so, you know, I'm comfortable in uncomfortable situations. Now, I go ahead and keep pulling up the map right here because I'm trying to figure out where I can be up out of here. And I chose, I think it was Path to the North. Yeah, I chose that because that's like the furthest distance and it's literally just a straight line to get to where I need to go. Now, for, like I said, I'm not good aiming with these. So y'all gonna see some gameplay hiccups of me just, just, just messing up the, the ebb and flow of things. It be like that sometimes. And it, if, <laughs> dude, I don't know what y'all, I was playing against actual people too. Somehow there was people who was worse than me. So we just gonna go ahead and count that as a W because that's a W to me then on it i'm not gonna lie i i look like such a noob playing this and again y'all gonna have to forgive me like i said i'm not accustomed to playing these type of games right here the the, the close experience i got is what warzone maybe and even then is i i'm kind of uffed in that in that category so I, i'm looking like a complete and total noob i guarantee some of y'all who have experience playing these type of games or whatever y'all gonna be like this this is this is light work like how was you struggling it's because i'm not like that in this game no sir not me and now for some places you need to have keys or whatever as you just seen i needed a stable key in order to get into that uh little spot right there so at this point i'm thinking to myself all right i need to get into some action and i need to go ahead and extract because i don't want to lose what i lost last time if you remember in the previous video we had a gold chain we had all type of guns we had all types of equipment and then what happened we get blewed up by a kobe worth like a Kobe wise grenade, bro. And just got blown to smithereens. And I'm upset about that. So I just want to get whatever I can get in my proximity and just get, get out of here. Now, as you can see, target acquired. Huh. We go ahead, peep that real quick. And I'm going for the immediate headshot, right? Immediate headshot. Trying to aim a little bit, trying to get right, trying to get, you know what I'm saying? My, my sights all acclimated. Because I don't want to get in no shootout with somebody who has a drop on me looking down. I don't want that. So I'm going to go ahead and get close while he ain't looking. Catch good buddy lacking. Pop him in his melon. And I'm <coughs> and I'm going to go ahead and uh, ransack him. Because that's what I do. Look. And he somehow didn't die after all that. It took like three or four shots, but whatever. I guess he had a helmet on that day. So we go ahead and go up here. And we're going to go ahead and collect this loot. And at this point, we're pretty close to the extraction point, too, which is nice, which is nice. But like I said, people, I get jumped. I get jumped. And I feel like the devs did this to me on purpose. Like they just knew I was going to struggle and I was going to panic because I panicked. I did. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going not gonna to sit here and act like I'm big, Mr. Big Bad. Nope. I panicked. I was. I was pretty damn certain I was going to die. Uh. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get into that part right now. A few moments later. So fun fact, when I was actually playing this, I swear the thing that said North and South Wheatfield, I thought it said North and South Weenie Hut. I was like, bro, what? So I hear gunfire, right? Now, I want some. I want a little bit of smoke, you know what I'm saying? It makes for good gameplay and also that's how you get better. That's how you get your aim up. Nothing could have prepared me for what I was about to run into because just when I thought it was safe, somebody decided to be a ghillie in the mist and start unloading at your boy. So I'll go ahead and run up real quick. I think that is safe. I think that's a little bit sweet right now. 
I was in for the rudest of awakenings. And when I say rudest of awakenings, I mean, look at that. Directly in front of me. He seen me. Popped me real quick. And like I said, I can't aim. Can't aim. I can't aim. Still can't aim. Got him. Target down. So I'll go ahead and check how much uh, uh, ammo I got. Got half magazine because I didn't fully spray. So I go up here to go and try to loot good buddy, right? Completely ignoring my radar. Just completely ignoring it, thinking that I, I had all the time, effort, energy, love, and care in the world. Just to find out, no, somebody was looking at the person who I was looting right now. Because you know what I do. I do a thorough search. I'm searching your pockets, your chest rig, all that stuff. Just to find out, plot twist, look at that. Ah! Somebody's now looking at me and approaching. So I try to go ahead and snipe him. You know what I'm saying? I try, I try to get in my American sniper bag. And he is literally leaning left and right, back and forth. Word to Aaliyah. And now I am panicking. Because like I said, I don't have no aim with these things at all. I literally, I'm shooting and hoping to God that something hits. I'm missing every shot. I hit that one, I'm pretty sure. My magazine chamber is empty. So what do I do? I switch to the AK. And good buddy's just looking at me. He did put a hot one in me. But then I go ahead and lay him down too. So now I try to get back to what I was doing before. I was so rudely interrupted. And loot his body. Now, I hear other people in here. But the uh, extraction point... Is literally up the street. So what what am I trying to do? I'm trying to skedaddle. I go ahead and loot good buddy for his SA85M, another automatic, because I'm trying to put as many bullets down range as possible. Considering how bad my aim is, that's the best option. Somebody shot at me. I don't know who. So I go ahead and go over here real quick. I'm trying to run. Trying to get some more loot, you dig? These folks won't leave me alone. They just won't leave me the, they just won't leave me alone. <laughs> at all. So I go ahead and loot, check his chest rig. What do I get? Some shotgun. And then what do I check in his pockets? What do you got for me? Nothing. I'm not taking a shotgun and, and some shells. That's probably why good buddy didn't really get too many crazy shots off on me because he had a shotgun out at, at, at a long uh, range battle right there. So right now, I go ahead and hit the extraction point, and now I'm safe and I'm alive. Eyes still alive. Teabag for victory, teabag for greatness because I made it out. I made it out. Yeah, While the pain, strife, and struggle, I made it. Gotta love it, man. Gotta love it. Now, folks, I do have a whole nother video, a whole nother game. Because I did record another one, and uh, it, it got ugly. I look terrible playing this. I'm not going to lie. The content that you're going to get from me watching this is not going to be the best setups the how you do this how you do that no it's watch me struggle and panic at y'all enjoyment and at my expense i mean for y'all enjoyment and at my expense so make sure as per usual if you did like this content that you do hit that like button comment and subscribe because we almost at that big 1k and again shout out to arena breakout for the sponsorship and the opportunity Make sure that you guys do play this game and download this because the worldwide launch is on July 14th. So make sure you go ahead and download that. I'm going to have my uh, my link or whatever in the description box below so y'all can pre-register. Make sure you do that. Play this game and then maybe send me your clips because who knows? I might make a compilation of like y'all greatness and or y'all struggles like mine. Your boy Uzula, and I'm gone.